Three more refugees were apprehended trying to flee to planet Solus 19. In other news, President Faraday has announced that Earth's water shortage is just a hoax and all is well in the world. I've been expecting you. So I have what you asked for. I delivered on my end, and let me tell you, it wasn't easy to come by. I believe you, Rose. I assure you, your efforts weren't in vain. Get the pleasantries, Glick. Get me off of this rock. In due time, in due time. I need to leave today. The transponder activates at 9, sharp. Any earlier, any later, no signal. No signal, no transport. But... Ah, my favorite starlet. Slow night tonight, huh, Glick? I've seen better. Your usual? Thank you, darling. It's been a most atrocious week. You always know the best medicine. Rose, this is Lillian. I've seen her films. Oh, a fan. Please tell me your favorite. So hard to decide. All of them? Oh, I know it's hard to choose. My favorite is Moon Men from Mars. You know, that's the first picture to star an off-worlder. I didn't. Oh, just between you and me, he couldn't keep his tentacles to himself. Lillian, what have you been working on recently? Oh, Glick, my career is in ruins. Don't say that, Lil. But it's true. The last three auditions I went on went to off-worlders. Uh, no, no offense. None taken, as usual. I don't care what president, I only care about ratings, Faraday says. There's no water. No water means no people. No people means no audience. Thanks for the drink, Glick, but uh, I'm gonna go to a table and wait. What's her deal? Her family made it off planet before the travel ban. She was going to join them when she raised enough funds, but she was too late. Now she's trapped. Oh, the poor dear. I could probably brighten her world. After all, I've been in the throes of despair. Anything I can get for you, Agent? You know, Glick, there just may be. Plutonian whiskey, your usual. Sure, but uh, I may have something else in mind as well. There's a rumor that someone's trying to get off world. Someone always is? Yeah, but the rumor is that that someone is coming here. Now you know this is a respectable joint, Agent Marsh. Care to see my papers? Unfortunately, not tonight, Glick. President Faraday has put a stop order to all interplanetary travel. Seems uh, too many people are leaving the planet, making his numbers look bad. So I'm sure if somebody were to slip through your fingers, it'd be a real career ender? <laughs> yeah, my career if I'm lucky. Uh, the president's really serious about this one. Uh, you know, it seems he's not too fond about outworlders either. I don't stick my antennae out for nobody. I know, Blick. That's why I like you. That's why you wouldn't mind if I uh, sit around and wait a while, right? Not at all. Who is that man? He's an interplanetary immigration agent. We had a deal. Look, the heat's too hot. Deal's off. I'll find some other way to pay you back. There is no other way. I need to get to my children. What brought you to this wretched planet anyway? Honestly, it was the sugar. Back on Solace 19, we don't have sugar. The rush I get from it is unlike anything I've ever felt before. It's the only time I truly feel alive. That is what my family does for me. They're my sugar, Glick. <sighs> 
take this. You have to use it at these coordinates. If you go into the restroom, I can tell Agent Marsh you slipped out the window. Thank you, Glick. You did the right thing. Uh, miss, you dropped your... Stop! Right there! Holy humanity! The travesty! Why can't we as human beings be decent to each other? Why? It's time. Go, kid. Go be with your family. Lillian, that was a hell of a performance out there. Glick, I did it all for my family.